What's up guys, Dave here from thegadgetbook.com. Today we're going to be showing you how to downgrade iOS 10 beta to iOS 9. So if you've upgraded to iOS 10 beta to try the new features such as messaging and the widgets and whatnot, a link will be in the description to all the new features. However, if you've updated, you can always go ahead and downgrade with this tutorial. So first of all, we need to go ahead and download the ISPW file, which is 9.3.2 in my case, to my computer. Once I've done that, I will be able to go ahead and launch up iTunes. And once I've got iTunes up, let's go into my little phone tab. Once I'm there, I'm just going to hold down the option key on Mac or the shift key on Windows and then press restore. Then you get a little window pop-up and basically you just got to direct yourself to where you store the firmware. Once I've chosen that, I can go ahead and restore my device with ease. So once you've restored your device, you won't be able to restore the backup which you've had on the iOS 10 firmware. You have to use the 9.3.2 backup for your 9.3.2 device, if that makes any sense. Let me know what you think in the comment section down below. So if this tutorial worked for you guys, make sure you hit the subscribe button, click the like button and let us know what you think about it in the comment section. And I'll catch you on in the next video.